Hey, how's it going, freelancers? Now, for any of you who don't know, last week it came to light that EA had filed a patent for a matchmaking algorithm to dramatically increase the odds for players to purchase microtransaction items. This is not the first time a publisher has filed for a patent like this, as Activision also filed for one similar last year. But this news was still met with expected concerns and criticisms, and fans of Bioware's upcoming Anthem expressed concern that this algorithm would be included when the game is released. However, technical design director Brennan Holmes took to Reddit in a brief post to assure fans this patent would not be included in Anthem, and that the game would still have fair matchmaking for PvP, by stating, I'm not sure where this is really coming from. We're not doing any of that though. For those curious, the patent by EA reads, the patent, Engagement Optimized Matchmaking, is specifically designed to keep players actively engaged in multiplayer games by adjusting matchmaking behind the scenes. Various player statistics are analyzed by the algorithm including player skill, sportsmanship, and playstyle, offensive or defensive preferences, and favored attacks. Within the EOMM framework, the core building components, skill model, churn model, and graph pairing model are uncoupled so that they can be turned and replaced independently. Moreover, we can even change the objective function to other core game metrics of interest, such as playtime, retention, or spending. EOMM allows one to easily plug in different types of predictive models to achieve the optimization. So to me, this is good news to hear that Anthem won't be implementing this matchmaking. Of course, this is still EA, so at some point they may still find other ways to push their agendas into Anthem, but for the moment being, it seems like Anthem will be free of microtransaction-based matchmaking. Also, another small note, as Anthem has hit another developer milestone, with the employees at Bioware Edmonton all gathered to talk about the progress being made on the game. So it appears progress on the game is running smoothly and on schedule. Hopefully in the coming months ahead, we will hear more details about the game itself, as well as the supposed open beta. Well that wraps up the small Anthem news video, but what did you think of the news that Bioware won't be using EA's patent? Do you trust EA at all? Are you excited for Anthem? Let me know in the comments below, and as always, if you like this video and you want to see more like it, be sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys on the next Shepard Gaming video. Keyless Alive.